All right, guys, welcome back to a brand new video of KD Gaming. And today we are here with how to craft for a baby icon or once to watches or anything like that. So today we're just going to be talking about that, uh, some investments that I did, because as you guys can see by my coins, I have 190K. Um, and we're also going to be opening these packs that I have right now. And I think I could do a bit more. But um, as you guys can see, once to watch summer player, once to watch play, which is any uh, once to watch. So let me just start off. Sorry if, sorry if you guys can hear something in the background, my bad. Uh, so what we're going to start doing is, so I'm going to start explaining you guys how to complete, like, for example, Flashback David Louise quicker or the base icon quicker or any, or any, like, any once to watches, something like that. So what you guys are going to be wanting to do is do some of these 81 to 86s because if you get an 81 and 82s, 81 or, or 82 rated you could submit them for the any ones to watches because the any ones to watch is untradeable because i prefer the untradeables guys because uh the tradable ones request uh team of the weeks and all that and it's very expensive right now so 82 rated ones to watch it could be a very bad ones to watch and then the rest could be like an 82 rated squad 82 rated players are uh cheap probably not now now they're going up in price so you better be trying to snipe those players right now so you first you need to like get a once to watch i don't know if you have one but if you guys do and if it's a bad one put him on here uh get an 82 rated squad if you don't you can do that 81 to 86 rated you completed uh let me just go to it let me just go to it let me just go to it so you complete this 81 to 86 i've already gotten for you guys so all you need is four non-rares uh simple and then the rest could be just bronzes or silver so we're gonna submit this and we're gonna see what we're gonna get so if we get an 81 or 82 we're gonna put it into the any ones to watch or if we get an 83 up to an 86 we can use it for the base icon upgrades i'm not gonna do it guys this is just for you guys so if you guys get any 83s and up uh you guys can use it for the base icon and the flashback davy louise if you guys really want it or it could be just for any prime icon sbc where it requires like 84 85 86 is rated squads and then you could just use those players they're untradeable they're not going to do anything in your club so might as well just use them for that so we're just going to open that pack oh god i'm on the updating store all right so there you go 81 to 86 let's see what we're going to get hopefully we get a walkout my luck hasn't been in with these okay so we're not going to get a walkout we are going to get bored so that's very good what rating is it? Oh, 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 oh god. Oh god. Alright, uh, just by looking at the flag, we're gonna get an 83 rated Savage. So if you get these 83s, you could put them into David Luiz, but David Luiz requires at least 84 rated squads. Uh, unless you put like an 85 in there and then just it could work. But, um, yeah, man, you could just use those players. Like, you could just craft, like, you don't even have to buy any players. Like, you could just use non rares. Put them in that and then get those players put into the um any ones to watches stuff like that so that's why it's very usable um and yeah that's basically it now some of the investments that i've decided to make because i'm at 190k coins by the way guys if you guys uh enjoy the video make sure you leave a like <laughs> and subscribe if you guys are new but um i'm currently at 190k because i decided to buy back drone Cancelo in form uh, I bought him for 178k, I believe. Yeah, so I did get him for 178k, um, but now he kind of went down in price. But he's been going up and down, so it doesn't really matter. He's just still gonna be at the same around like price. But I do believe that Cancelo is gonna get an upgrade this year, this year. Well, this winter upgrades. So when the Serie A comes out, the upgrades, I do believe that Cancelo's 81 rated card will become an 83. And that his informs are also going to go up by 2. So his 84 is going to become an 86. 86, which is this one, is going to become an 88. And the other one, 87, is going to become an 89. So that's why I've decided to get the 86 rated inform because it's a right back. Um, and if he does get an upgrade, he's going to become an 88. And I do believe his price will go up. That's exactly what I think. Uh, it's a risk. I'm not really good at this trading kind of stuff. But I do believe his price is going to go up. Um, so that's why I decided to invest in him because he's always stuck around this price the 170s and all that So that's why I decided to get him and I'm just gonna wait until the Serie A Upgrades come out and all that and all those SPCs all that kind of stuff and hopefully his price goes up so I can get a bit of coins um, 
But yeah, and another player that I also did invest is a player who's been playing really well. As far as I hear it from people and all that. I don't really watch him much. But a lot of people have been saying Arthur from Barcelona has been playing very well for Barca this year. Um, his current card is an 82 non-rare, I think. I think it's a non-rare. And his UCL card is an 83 rated. So if he gets an upgrade to an 83 or 84, his Champions League card is going to also go up in rating. And his price is for sure, for sure going to go up. Because as, as of right now, he's going for like 12k or even a little bit less than that. Uh, I got it for 12.5k, but I do believe that if he gets an upgrade uh, and his Champions League, if his Champions League card gets an upgrade, he is going to go up, guys, uh, to like maybe an 85 or 84. It depends what, how much ratings he goes up by, but for sure his price is going to go up. So you better be investing in these players. Sometimes we got to think with our heads, you know, we got to think about who's been playing well this season or year. And who you guys believe is going to go up in ratings. And then that's why you got to buy their cheap, like, informs or stuff like that. Only special cards actually go up from the cards that you buy. Because if you buy a normal card like Arthur right now, 82 rated, his card doesn't go up. It's only, like, his special cards. So, you got to think, man. You got to watch football. Uh, <laughs> but, um, yeah, that's basically it. Like, who I invested in. That's why I'm at 190k. I've also been doing a bit of bronze packs. Because a lot of people say this bronze pack method is very good. And I did get a bit of coins from it, guys. I did get a bit of coins from it, and I did sell those players, and I've actually been getting a bit of profit. So, it's actually very good. Um, I've also been looking into my club, looking at silvers to see, you know, sometimes they're expensive now that these league SPCs are coming out, like Liga Nos, for example, today, and Alessandrini and all those players. I did sell these players for a bit of coins, like, as you guys can see, 3.9, 3K, uh, 1.1, and 2.4K, that's a... That's why it's always good to look at silvers in your club, especially the rare ones. Sometimes they're more expensive than the rare golds. Um, I do have, I do also have to sell these 83 rates because now they're starting to like go up in price, including the 82s. But um, anyways, man, that's really it. Who I had like what I had to explain. Uh, that's what's called crafting. A lot of YouTubers do it, and I also do it now. Um, but yeah, man, it's just basically 81 to 86s. Get players from that. Put them in the base icon upgrades if you want. Or Davy Luiz. Or the any of the ones to watches. But in my opinion, guys, the ones to watch summer tradables is not worth it. Because there's not many players that are worth that much in the ones to watches. Um, obviously, there's Ronaldo, Felipe Anderson, Mares, Cancelo. Those are probably the four most expensive. Uh, sorry if I miss anyone. But I do believe those are the four most expensive players. Um, there's also nine golems and all that, but they're not really as expensive as those four players. You have to be really lucky to get those. Or you might just get a bad player, and you wasted a full team of 84 rated players with an inform, with the ones to watch. Because every 84 rated is going for about, like, what, 7k and up, I think? Um, that's why it's not really good to do any of these ones to watch. Uh, some more tradables, or even the untradables untradables but i decided to do one just to see what i get and that's it like i'm done but i prefer that any wants to watch his own tradable because it's only an 82 rated squad there's a there's loads of 82s in the in fifa <laughs> in fut so that's why i think this one is really good value of money you know wants to watch and then you just keep doing those spcs so i don't want to ramble for too much we're just going to open those two packs and see what we're going to get and if we get a bad wants to watch guys I will put him back into the SPC and do another 82 rated squad. So we're going to open the anyone's to watch first. Hopefully we can get lucky. Here we go. First one. Anyone's to watch. Are we going to get anything? We do get a walkout. Okay. Anyone's to watch guys. We do get a walkout. It is going to be Greek center back Socrates. Now that is amazing. That is amazing because I've been wanting to actually get him. Sometimes I think about my squad what I should build. Two next right and i think i just got a perfect player who links with petr check goalie premium spc and that is perfect that is actually perfect guys obviously this all depends on luck too you know i never really get lucky in these packs but now i did but uh we do get a socrates in the winter ones to watches and this is the summer one right I, yeah i think it's the summer one he just recently also got an upgrade, I think, because of, like, Team of the Group Stage Europa League or something like that. Or live cards, I'm not sure. But uh, it's a very good card, you know. It's actually a very good card. He links with Petr Cech. So I could try him out later on. I'm actually planning to build a new team with... I, 
I really want to get the Davy Luiz guys. I really want him uh, to put him in my new team. Uh, well, in the team that I have. I will explain it to you guys after how I want to build the team next. Uh, but here we go, guys. Once to our summer player. This is obviously a bigger one, kind of. Uh, it would be fun if we don't get a walkout on this now. But here we go. Once to our summer player. Untradeable as well. Who are we going to get? Okay, we do not get a walkout. And that's the thing with these ones to watch is summer uh, SBCs, guys. We are going to get Brazilian center mid. We're going to get Fred. Okay, so we're going to get Fred. He hasn't got an upgrade this year, I believe. And probably isn't going to uh, anytime soon. Man United just beat Chelsea. But does Fred even start? I don't even know. I don't watch United games that much. But um, he hasn't got an upgrade yet. So that's why I don't really know. I feel like I might actually submit him, guys, into the any wants to watches. But it's still decent, you know. We get Fred. Um, all right, let me just get him into the club. I'm actually happy that we got Socrates. Let me just show you guys quick my team first, uh, how I want to build it. So I did get gold one once again, guys. No highlights again, but I did get gold one. I've been playing so well with this new team, guys. It's incredible. For the third time week, third time week, uh, does that even make sense? For the third uh, time week in a row if that makes sense. I've gotten gold one three times in a row Which is a new thing that I've never done. I've done gold one twice in a row But never three times and that's an incredible record. I really want to get elite three That's my goal by the end of the year I'm for sure gonna get it, I believe especially when the team gets even better with your Zeb you and all that and all those players, but um Yeah, I'm mean, gonna team played amazing, but this is the team that I'm trying to build right now guys So I want to check um, I wanted Milito as a right back because his natural position in real life is a right back. If you guys didn't know, at Porto, he plays as a right back. Um, that's his nat natural position. And he actually fits really well as a right back. He has good stack, good stats. Oh my god, I, sometimes I can't say words. Uh, his stats are decent for a right back. Uh, so, I really want to try him out on 7 chem as a right back. Uh, now he's at 5, but like once I get another Brazilian center back, which is Davi Luiz... I want to get him, not just for this new team, guys, but I'm also planning to build the uh, Benfica past and present squad later on with like Eusebio, Rui Costa, and all these past players. And David Luiz obviously used to play for Benfica, so I really want to get him. His stats are amazing, man. One of the best flashbacks on the game already, David Luiz. So he's there, right? Uh, he links with Edmil Itel. He puts him on 7 cam, Edmil Itel. Uh, David Luiz is also here. And then here in the middle, would be 20-ish K player that goes by the name of Fabinho, who is also a very good player. Obviously, the cheapest one. Um, there you go, Fabinho. He would put David Luiz on full cam, and and yeah, that's uh, that's it really. Fabinho would also be on full cam with this new center back, who who was gonna be Van Dyke, but now that I got Socrates, guys, I will maybe try to change up something. Uh, I will try to change something. So I'm going to put Socrates in. There you go. I was planning Van Dyke the new 88 rated. Because then I would put 83 rated Robertson as a left back. And he would be on full cam. They would both be on full cam. But now I have Socrates here. Socrates is already on full cam. And then I would need another left back. Um, left backs from Arsenal is not really that great, is there? Uh, Monreal. Kalasinac? No, not Kalasinac. Uh, I don't know. But um, yeah, that's why I was planning Robertson going here because here at left mid I can also put Sané now and then I would just put someone else here at left back but I was planning Van Dyke and then the new upgrade of Robertson so both new upgraded versions of Van Dyke and Robertson they would go here and that would be the team I do believe that would be a sick team let me know in the comments guys if you guys want me to build this new team um, I want to try it out I really want this David Luiz I really want him uh, he ends on Wednesday I think so I really got to get him quick and um yeah man so leave a, a comment if you guys want me to build this team or or i could just leave a vote on the top right on the video uh just saying yes or no new team or not and you guys can just vote to see what you guys want so that's the new team i was planning but um yeah so that is it now guys i think i might just do one more any wants to watch this i'm gonna put in fred because i don't believe fred is gonna get anything um i don't believe fred is gonna get anything he hasn't got anything till now so I'm just going to put him in the any wants to watch untradeable because I don't want to put a team of the week for the any wants to watch or the wants to watch summer. So we're going to put our wants to watch player Fred and I will sell those tradable wants to watches that I did pack uh, which was the Chinese guy the 75 rated Wu Lei I think and um, 
not Kagawa. Well, maybe Kagawa. No, but Kagawa isn't needed for the rating. 85 is way too. I don't know. But I did pack Piatek, and I did submit him because he was untradeable anyways, guys. So I, I just decided to... Oh, my. Did I just get no more gold Fred? Oh, my God. I'm such an idiot. Um, Okay, there you go. Wants to watch. But, yeah, I decided to submit him because, you know, uh, he's untradeable. So why not? So we're going to put Fred in here. And now I'm just going to build a whole 82 rated squad, and I'll be right back so that we don't waste any time. Alright guys, so I've just completed the team. It was pretty quick. I didn't actually have to cut it off. But I don't want to waste anyone's time. So here's the 82 rated squad with the ones to watch. I obviously decided to use Fred. And then just a full team of 82s except for Versalco who is untradeable. And Peace Check are also... So they're both untradeable basically. So they're both 81s and they're both untradeables. And I'm going to get them a bunch of times back. If I keep doing the 81 to 86 upgrades. Um, and especially from other packs, from rewards and all that. So... Yeah, nothing much to explain. For sure, they're going up in price right now, guys. I know. But um, it's fine. So here we go. We're going to submit it in. There we go. There goes Fred. Bye-bye, Fred. And hopefully, we get a bigger wants to watch than him. Or at least a walkout or something like that. So, yeah, guys. That's basically it for the how to craft thing. Uh, hopefully, you guys did understand. Uh, it's pretty simple, you know. I, I'm not going to repeat it. It's pretty simple. But, um... Yeah, it's, it's pretty simple. You don't have to really buy players, really, unless you guys have nothing in your club, like exactly nothing. But you should be able to have like non-rare golds and you could just submit those and get, get those players from that pack and just submit it to base icons, Davy Louise and all that. So that's how people do it. That's how I'm going to do it. And I'm already doing it. I'm um, saving up players for those SBCs. I want to get Davy Louise, like I said. And uh, yeah, so here we go guys, probably the final pack of the video. I will be doing more of these off camera, but if I do get good players, I will record them and put them in the video somewhere. Uh, not this one today, but maybe like tomorrow or whenever I upload. So here we go guys, once to watch player any. Let's see if we can get lucky in this. Here we go. Uh, we don't get a walkout, okay, so then it was bad. It also depends on your luck, you know. This really depends on your luck. We are gonna get Boodaboos, so even worse than Fred. I probably shouldn't have done it, you know, but that's the thing. It depends on your luck. If I got like a Ronaldo, it would have been so worth it, but I didn't. I got Boodaboos, which is worse, so it's it wasn't really worth it in this occasion. So that's basically it. Uh, so now I'm going to put him into the SBC again and use other 82 rated like that so that's how it basically is guys hopefully you guys did enjoy the video subscribe if you guys are new turn the bell on so you guys never miss any videos like these uh if you guys want more of these like methods that kind of stuff uh leave a like or a comment down below if you guys want any of more like of these methods or stuff like that so yeah leave a like if you enjoyed and tomorrow we'll be, we'll be back with another video i don't know what maybe fifa maybe david's nhl Maybe WWE. I am going to start trying to upload at 4 p.m. Like WWE Karimo so we can get it out of the way. And then at 8 p.m. it will be something else like NHL or FIFA or anything like that. So just so you guys know, that's why you got to turn on the bell. And yeah, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Peace. And now I'm going to do more of these packs. <laughs> Peace and see you next time. Goodbye.